Hi and welcome back to your MESE lesson. I'm Natalie. Now that you understand the concept of asking be past plus prepositional phrase questions, let's really practice. Remember to focus on your pronunciation and conversation speed. Please listen first and then ask me the full question. Let's learn the expression for to not know about something that other people know about, to be in the dark. In the dark about our plans to cut out early on Friday, please ask me about our manager. Good job. Please repeat. Is our manager in the dark about our plans to cut out early on Friday? On top of my workload for the next couple of weeks, please ask me. Good job. Please repeat. Are you on top of your workload for the next couple of weeks? Let's learn the expression for to be under someone's control, to be under someone's thumb. Completely under Sharon's thumb these days. Please ask me about Dean. Very nice. Please repeat. Is Dean completely under Sharon's thumb these days? Let's learn the expression for to owe money to be in the hole. In the hole for almost $9,000 on her credit card, please ask me about Lauren. Excellent. Please repeat. Is Lauren in the hole for almost $9,000 on her credit card? Let's learn the expression for to be broken or not working properly, to be on the fritz. On the fritz again, please ask me about the air conditioning. Good. Please repeat. Is the air conditioning on the fritz again? Let's learn the expression for to feel happy because you are doing something that you like and are good at, to be in your element. Really in her element when she gets up on stage to sing, please ask me about Lucy. Please repeat. Is Lucy really in her element when she gets up on stage to sing? Let's learn the expression for to be nervously waiting to see what is going to happen, to be on pins and needles. On pins and needles waiting to hear whether she got the job or not, please ask me about Karen. Good. Please repeat. Is Karen on pins and needles waiting to hear whether she got the job or not? Let's learn the expression for to be secretly planning something with someone, to be in cahoots with someone. In cahoots with Marcus to plan a surprise party for Missy, please ask me about Theo. Good. Please repeat. Is Theo in cahoots with Marcus to plan a surprise party for Missy?
Well done. Please practice with this video until you're able to ask questions fluently. Remember, you can always practice more by using the vocabulary to make your own questions. When you're ready, move on to video C to test your progress. I'm Natalie and I look forward to seeing you next time. Good luck.